La Sonambula, or The Sleepwalker, was choreographed by George Balanchine to the music of Rieti. He sets this work in the 19th century at the lavish home of an aristocrat, the Baron. During a party, the Baron is hosting with a coquette, his mistress. The choreography for the ensemble demands speed and nimbleness of foot with a splendid ballroom polonaise. Suddenly, an unexpected guest arrives, the poet. The Baron welcomes him. As the party continues, the coquette and the poet are drawn together and dance a seductive pas de deux. The party continues as the guests are invited for supper and depart the stage, led by the Baron and Coquette, leaving the poet alone in the ballroom. He suddenly becomes aware of the entrance of the sleepwalker, the Baron's wife, as she makes her way into the solitude of the poet. She seems to him half dream, half woman. He is completely entranced by this eerie and elusive remote ideal. Here, the choreography is delicate and hauntingly beautiful. The unseen sleepwalker conveys lyrical desperation as she moves continuously on point and eludes the reaching hands of the poet as he attempts to bring her into his own orbit of reality. She fades from his encircling arms. She steps over the barrier of his prone body. However, there is now a sense that she is aware of his presence. As the sleepwalker glidingly begins to exit back to her room, the coquette enters and sees the poet following her and becomes jealously enraged. She tells this to the Baron, who finds the poet and stabs him to death. The sleepwalker claims the body of the poet and accepts him in her arms and carries him away, leaving the guests stunned and shocked. This brief ballet reveals the reality, formality, and decadence of the prevailing society.